Hey everyone, it is Saturday. It was a long week this week, so I'm definitely excited to be in the weekend. Now today I have a couple of errands I need to run. Uh, that's going out to get some breakfast. I have to also go out and get my second COVID vaccine shot, I can say it. And then also have to visit with uh, my mother. And then after that, I hope to do a couple of video projects today, uh, exploring the city of Chicago and even the surrounding suburbs. So. Uh, yeah, I think I'm ready to get started, so let's have at it. All right, this is a new tripod that I just bought. It's actually a Polaroid tripod, and it is, I believe, 75 inches in height. Uh, it's not fully extended just yet, but overall, I needed a new tripod to shoot videos and have something steady to hold my camera. And so this is what I was able to find. It costs about $44 via Amazon so yeah it wasn't terribly priced too high or anything like that but uh, it's a tripod that I'm definitely planning on using and I'm going to set up a live shot now just so you can see it all right this is me with the tripod or with the camera on the tripod and it's a great height it allows you to see pretty easily and since I'm a taller person uh, being 6'2 it helps that the tripod extends higher or up to 75 inches because it accounts for my height and it allows me to speak directly to the camera. So I'm definitely excited about using this tripod and I plan to get a lot of use out of it. Uh, so uh, let's continue having a little fun on this uh, Saturday. Also, I want to note since I'm a meteorologist, I figure I got to talk about the weather and it feels great outside right now. Uh, we have uh, some overclass, overcast skies at the moment, but uh, it feels wonderful outside. I would say it's probably about 74, 75 degrees already, and it's about 8 or 9 in the morning. So we're expecting a warm day, a warm weekend across Chicago. So I'm hoping to take advantage of that and uh, just get outside and enjoy the outside. So I'm about to head to our first stop, which is Honey Jam Cafe located in Downers Grove, Illinois. Now, one of my colleagues at my part-time job mentioned this restaurant to me, and I had the opportunity to uh, actually go to the restaurant a couple of weekends ago, but I figured I'd give it a, a second try to see what else I would enjoy, and then also get some of it on the footage as well. So uh, I'm about to head off now. I've got to drive safely, so uh, no recording while I'm driving. So I just made it to the Honey Jam Cafe located in Downers Grove. As you see, we're still in the pandemic era, so I have my mask on, but I'll take it off once I get uh, my entrees and my drinks, or probably just one drink. Uh, but I'm definitely looking forward to it, and they have a large menu, so <laughs> yeah, I'm still ha I still have to figure out what I will actually get. I heard the chicken rancheros here were pretty good. Uh, but I'm also interested in just getting a classic, you know, scrambled eggs, sausage, uh, that type of breakfast. So we'll see what I end up deciding. All right, this is the first entree, the Nutella crepes. <laughs> they look wonderful with the bananas and the strawberries. I'm definitely looking forward to uh, digging into this. All right, I have my entree, at least my second entree. This is the uh, avocado toast that Honey Jam Cafe offers. I'm excited to try it out. It also has some potatoes and also some scrambled eggs with a cheddar cheese. So I'm very excited about digging into this. So I just finished up at Honey Jam Cafe located in Downers Grove, Illinois, and it was very tasty. I end up ordering the Nutella crepes, which were very good. I'm a big fan of Nutella. I'm so happy I discovered Nutella in my life. Uh, but I also ordered some avocado toast, and those were really good too, along with scrambled eggs and also some sausage links. So if you are looking for a place to grab uh, some really good breakfast that is served very quickly and conveniently located in the Chicago area, uh, definitely think about Honey Jam Cafe. Now on to my next destination. 
All right, next stop on my agenda is to get my second vaccine shot. I ended up getting the Pfizer vaccine. And the first shot, I didn't feel any symptoms whatsoever. So I'm hoping that that's also the case for the second shot. Now, again, it's a beautiful day. I hope after this second shot, I can continue to enjoy this beautiful day. All right, I'll let you know what it's like on the other side. All right, so I just finished getting my second vaccination shot. I'm gonna try not to get hit by a car as I'm recording video too. And uh, overall, it was a, still a, a smooth process. It was a little bit of a delay because they were prepping the vaccines in the back of the facility. And so I was waiting around for about uh, 40 minutes before they started vaccinating people again. And when I think about my first time going, it only took about 40 minutes in total between walking in the door, uh, getting the vaccine, and then waiting the 15 minutes while they watch to see if there's any type of reaction with you. Uh, but overall, wasn't too bad. Very happy to have gotten my second vaccine shot and looking forward to uh, being protected as best as possible from uh, this deadly uh, pandemic, this deadly uh, virus going around, the COVID-19. Uh, COVID um, yeah, just it's very good to have some vaccination protection. So uh, we'll see how I feel. Hopefully I don't develop any symptoms. When I got my first shot, I did not have any symptoms whatsoever. And uh, so we'll see if that's still the case for the second round. All right, so I finished all the errands I had to run for today. That included going out to get breakfast this morning from uh, Honey Jam Cafe right there in Dallas Grove. It was very tasty. I enjoyed all the entrees, but I think the crepe was what stole the show for me, so I really enjoyed that. Also, that mimosa was pretty good as well. But yeah, everything was really tasty. Uh, then after that, I got the opportunity to see my mother. Although I didn't film any of that, it was really nice seeing her and spending time with her as well. And then after that, I got my second shot, my second dosage of my COVID-19 vaccine, of the COVID-19 vaccine, one of them at least, the Pfizer vaccine. And so far, I don't feel any symptoms or anything like that, but they did say stay hydrated. And uh, that's what I plan on doing for the rest of the day today. So outside of that, nothing else major going on for me this weekend. But if you're out there thinking about something to do, maybe it is time to go out and get something to eat, or maybe just drive around and explore. Uh, but either way, thanks for watching, and until the next video, hey, have a great day.